so so rufinye eh a ri go funye bi fana ni When they are in our air space within here, it is what guides them. So when they did the calibration, it passed. It passed. It passed. So, but once it lands here, then they are now instrumental. The one now that will guide the, the aircraft to land. So for you now, I want this man from where you go to isn't it? Yes. Now for you, you land to we shall keep on hiring the man to come. No, no, no. We have been trained in the system. And, uh, once it is handed over to us. So now, if we want to develop another airport like this, we take you, can you build it without? No. This is African. No, but the manufacturer. What I'm saying, if you have, because I found the man here, was a lot of demand. And you have been working on this here. Have you took up that knowledge that when we have this, want the same in Uganda, you, the man who paid him, it can be paid to Uganda and everything. 
It's very possible, but uh, it's possible to involve uh, some investment to do with the, because it requires a plant, a lot of wear to be, to be able to manufacture the system. No, but the system we can procure. The, yes, installation. The 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 installation. So we should not hire that man anymore when we're doing airports. Next time you can hire us. <laughs> <laughs> because I found all of the man, they told me, just doing it, there are very few. The man might have been like six or seven years. So this expert is in his evening. So in that case now, <laughs> If you have copied, then that is very good. <laughs>
Uganda yateka mu sente ezikiri mu kulaba nti efuma mafuta gafu okuva wansi yo mutaka ata mafuta gano gasima tulina kubaka ebyuma bigasima ne ntambule nnungi government ne funa taka lino funa sali kibira nga mulimu na amayega yatya kyova watya kitaka bali government ne funa sente kuzimba ekisawe kino kigenda kugwaka nnyonyo nnene nnyonyo nnene ze bayita anti no 256 la kago nga watani lukago mu mundu gumu nyonyo ze sika gwentebe kubanga nene nyo ze zigendo kubanga zigwa wano nga zireta ebyo byuma bigenda kufuna mafuta kubanga bizito wanyo ekisawe kino twakitande ko maka gwa 2018 tumaze emyaka mukaga nga bakizimba emirimo jakosebwa mu ku lwe emyaka gwe twamale ebiri ya covid emirimo gwe tutambula bulungi ne yimirira naye singa te ali covid singa twakimalaga mabega ne kutuka nge nsimbi ekyawera bulungi kubanga ekyimbi zali zigenda mu covid ekisawe kino yetukide ka kati ya, ya kiriko budget ya trillion 1.188 trillion mu sente za Uganda then ku sente ezo twaka spendinga ko 1.08 trillion kadde sente za Uganda zetu akateka ko sawe kino muri mu mugulaba ranwe mugirabye a eri tamino mugirabye de apron mugirabye nebintu ebirala so far tuliku 95% kula bade first phase kwa kubanga first phase we muri mu guli expensive nyo kati ngo tuliddalo wala sente nyingi kubanga bajitandika wazi ofisi singa makumi ya 3 ngabaji zimo kudda wagulu ndiyo singa nyo kulia sente atina kya singa moto kosa wano price selection ulenta lezalo wa bweru mu covid ebijali mu bweru kubanga twakitandika cement yali ya yali ya bijali ya kati tusubira omwe mako gujjo mwezi gwo mwenda kija kubanga kiwedde nje tuje first phase saba za kago kago ebyuma binene ebigenda kujja wanga bitwala mafuta twasala wo tuteke kumpi no basima mafuta nti ezo moto kaze nene ne zandi tambuje kuve Kampala okuvawa nti biruwa nga bigenda kuteke kati ya mafuta nga tugali kumpi awo okusima ati wanu wonyini omuntu wanu gamenda kutekawo za city of park tukimaze kisawe tuli basanyufu nyo kubanga lwa government ye nyale mu kufa ku bantu banga mafuta gano bagajja government yefuna zabye yongera tuna ke kisawe kino ekimala second phase ekenda kuba passenger services bange no international airport eja kuba saba za bantu abafuruma waweruwe gwanga naba batambulira munda mu gwanga kati yawo phase dako kuzimba tamine nene ne bilale bigenderako okulaba anti twetegekera ba passenger abagenda kubanga bajja wana abafuruma waweruwe gwanga naba ingira gwanga wano watuli wano twina a uh, tourism attractions nyingi nyo wano mu bunyoro ati nechira abanji bajja kubanga bakola business mafuta gete baga ato kugwende batambule ku kubo eze sawe bit bajja kubanga bakola direct babirenga bagenda kokola bimbo jabo mura bya makuba ga access nge ya politimazo gakola katuli mu final touches nebi atu ino kutereza kulaba ngo mwako gujjo gwe mwezo gwo mwenda kisacho tuchukula ko tutongole juzi twafuna ko enyonyi ejo kitestinga bajja bibalaga video muzirabe enyonyi yajja yajja kutestinga erabe ebintu bebakoze bikana no mutindo kwensi yonna kujukira ke mabega awe emyaka ebiri eyise mabega waliwo kulwanagana kwa mai katugamba there is no value for money ate nebimara nebiterera kubanga ofisi ndi aliyeva mu bantu wa faba government benyini naitwa mali tujitereza Tuvura kati ulimo bwa contractor bwa koze mulunja to contractor ko tuina ali expert mu kukole bisawe akoze bisawe binji sio na atino mulimo bwa twade kwa njawulo na advice ya twade era bana Uganda bayino bwa basanyu kubanga esente zaabwe zitukozeseza ya denga yali loan na yera tusasula atenga tusasula loan yenga tukozesa sente zo muwo musuru tuli basanyu fu okola bintu jitu
kitole kuchikulawo kitandi kokola ngabo tulinda okutandi ka second phase Ngovude kumazi na ama sanyarazi Mula bane run uwe bali mjikuru vinga Juzi mwala bentebe tuafuna kwa accident Nyonye emu neva ku run uwe Negenda monsuko Na hika tiba kula guru vinga Nyonye zi wazili hefe Tisura kufako Nechila lebisika dibi ya tekiniko Munda Masanyarazi Matala Hebi nitu kwe biti Hebele kitu kukula Nga wabi maliza na hebi ni mesinge wende Na ukula hebi nitu yeba kula Muli mu ene defect Bajidemu Kati ya five percent imazo kusigala, no kulete generate nene ebiu mebi tera kola, control tao ebi mebi controlling enyoni, na yero de order zata ndi se, tu subira e ya percent ya sigadeo kula banti, ichisa wachinu chikwa, bachi tu kuasa solo chikola, walima nyonya zijao ngam kutestinga, nzigo au burundi, nzibere ngazi tamani ebi mo ya sigadeo ya take ni kumpola mpola. Ona le kuto, ati o. Tu malawa no. We took Malawi in the first phase. The two in the Kuwait South, we took Malawi to go to the second phase. Second phase, we are focusing on the take away of Zimbabwe. We are going to take away 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 Zimbabwe. We are Kubanga tukalisi kutuwa nyoti Iyo kutandika second phase Sawa zinu wali mkwa kutetika fizibite stade Mwemana ajimaliza miezi ingevili maso Miezi mga mkwa katusubira Kubanga tutandise Kufuna kutuwa nyoti Kukulaba anti second phase Ikenda maso Na iyo miaka ange satu maso Kujia kwa wamaze Mbaba antu Bata ambula internationale And domestically Kuhita kuchisawe chino Nichaka walega Itanasuni ya potu Tuwa maro gazeti ngerinya Katine siye, ili mkavu efuwe, uo gazeti nge kisawe. Mkishito ngole, echi kwa saka nye, tambla yomu banga, chenzi yona. Mkishusubila mu banga, litono, baji ya kubanga wa mazo chikole. Mkishusubila mu, wakina tuwa sente nga mba. Chino, mchele na biyuganda bichiwa katika zimbe bisha au, kufunua bantu ba fudhawa iri mu Afrika. Wano, contractor afudhawa iri mu Afrika. Na yeye contractor ndo bichiwa mu amrimo, bichiwa mteka mu akakua kuli zomu contract. Tiaba na bwa ino kose sa, na inte pasi tiba na kuwa ba na biyuganda. Kwenye tuleka yao ten pasi, alete ba na work spots, ngao ba zimbe chiri, ichume chikontrolingo bwe ngole chetulabi. Yeye tiaba na wafu wafu nyemu nyio. Bafunye mwaka sente, wadeba sasura bulunji Ate, awade Osoma, bafunye mu skills Bafunye mu skills Ukule biya masanyarazi Ukule biya air navigation Na bino, kukuzimba ziranwe Na yu of course Skills ya bafunye Teso kuba garanti inga ukula banti Na utu wawo kuzimbe chisawo Kati government, tukenda chiteka mwe Nkola anga president wa tuwa kuwabulwa Kabana wana wabanga mafunye skills wezi tuwajewo, tuwatuwale wabwelu. Uyengere ukubangulwa. Emiake jem maso, nafe tusobolo kose sabana wafu ukuzimbe bisa wabwelu. Tukubanga science, habana wabasu mye kose hezo mwebali. Wabafu na experience, ingawa nunga tubo ngera yo. Beyo ngele ukubangu, kambiyo wizi wawo. Emiake jem maso, uja kusanga nafe Uganda, wetu na asimla nyesi na kusayansi. Kusumi sabana wa science. Uja kusanga nafe tuzimbe ichisipe. Na imu ni mwa wano rede, haba ina yuwa kute. Ati na uvaso wa bikola, kubanga experience, wati jiwa nune wagena watu kwa lele nte. Mwebali ya watu. Wanarewa. Aaaa, wano, tumanyi wetu wetu rode. Kamira. 
Wabada wa ntubanji nga bogira. Tikari ya kasozi kemula wa. Kandivanga straight ku sawe chafe. Of course the report is tuzifunye na nenda hafe tukula verification. Chachimiche tunabiyere ero. Ngafe abasi verification batu gamba. Yorutu ya wenyi tegenda yo. Na yo of course. Wala bila musechu ito company to vit. Ngaba kari ya kasozi hatu wali wenchi vila. Government way to lead. Ate government tenu wanga vitu vya ayo uh, Tumazo chila ba uh, Tumazo chila ba 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 Na haka soza hako Na haka lachone chisoboka Na hitu kenda chitu wala nga government Tulabe chiche soboka na ukola ho Watu wedi zetaka ni tuluka la mwebi Lachi lachone chisoboka Na ye kati ya icho Techino kubela nsonga kati Kubanga ba experts in government uwevali Haa uh, Minister of Defence, Minister of Security, and Minister of Works together with the Minister of the CIA, which is the Chandoling, we are going to go to the Chisa, we are going to go to the Chisa, we are going to go to the Chisa. Then, we are going to go to the Chisa. Now, we are going to go to the Chisa, we are going to go to the Chisa, then, we are going to go to the Chisa, 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 Sazo otuwa kera tuina ba staff abava usimu vyesu na sorite Kata abagendo kubanga baba ira wano Nga uba taking over kubwa mkontrakita kubanga kontrakita Mwilimu uguwa kukoze Tuto ya nza tuto ya nza ikede Much today we are specifically here To do our oversight role To cover the international airport Which was formerly covered international airport Covered international airport was the project name Because this is covered area Covered village But later through cabinet, we named it Kabarega International Airport. Uh, this airport, the name was already gazetted. Now the Civil Aviation Authority is working very fast to gazette the airport as per the requirement by a cow. That's the, those are the ones who manage all aviation issues. Uh, this airport, the, the, construction, the construction works commenced in 2018. Today we are six years down the road. We should have finished like two years back, but there is that issue of COVID-19, which hindered most of the projects across the world. Uh, those were like two years wasted. Workers couldn't do any work because of the sickness of COVID-19. But uh, as we speak now, the works are in high gear, and we are up to 95 percent. You have seen the runway but now they are doing additional layer of grooving such that it is safe for those big heavy aircrafts. One aircraft carries about 600 tons of cargo. The ones going to carry the, the heavy oil refinery equipment so that they land here safely without any accident. You have seen the terminal. It is being completed. They are installing electric lights and those other electric gadgets. Uh, then also you have seen the firefighting area is finished. Then also, you have seen many things. And also the, the, the 5% remaining includes the heavy generators which are going to bring to land the different systems, the, the mobile control tower which will control the landing, uh, electricity connection to this area, and the water. Then also installation of a few minor equipments in the buildings. That one will bring it to 100%. And we hope by by September of next year, we shall be able to commission this airport to receive the heavy aircrafts, which will be carrying the oil refinery equipment. Uh, then after that, we are doing the, the, the feasibility study to update it, to embark on the second phase for the passenger services. Because people would wish to land here internationally, we have a lot of tourism here in the Bunyuru sub-region. Then also those connecting to the northern Uganda, they would also prefer to land here directly. They cross through Masindi, they go to West Nile, northern Uganda. Even those will be coming for the oil projects and other conferences. So that's the viability of us having this international airport here. And it will be bigger than the Entebbe airport for the purposes I have told you. We know uh, the contractor has been here He's not even from Africa, and he has good experience. He has done 
some other airports and other projects outside Uganda, even Uganda. And we gave him a clause in the contract that 90% is <laughs> only Ugandans. And for the last six years, our own Ugandans have got money here. They have been working and being paid. And those who had skills have gained more skills from here. But however, the skills they have got cannot guarantee them that we should get rid of those people from outside Africa to come and help us to construct, to construct airports. But now it is our role as government, the ones who have got little skills to take them for further studies. In some years to come, they also get the same skills like those who have been coming from out. And we shall take on that because Uganda is developing and we need to empower our own scientists. But however, there are those who had skills and they have gained electrical skills, mechanical skills, they can do even without either the contractors from outside Africa. That's where we are now today and uh, currently we are recruiting workers through Civil Aviation Authority, a few of them, and uh, we shall also get those who are already in the system to come and teach those who will come so that by September next year we have people on the ground. Where we are, adjacent there is going to be an industrial park. And just a few kilometers here is where the oil, the, the, the oil wells and the oil, oil refining is being done. So really, it is just viable that this airport was needed here. Our project has costed us 1.188 trillion Ugandan shillings. And so far, we have spent 1.08 trillion Ugandan shillings. Our uh, idea at first, the money was not reaching 1 trillion, but what increased it to 1 trillion point something, one was the price escalation. By the time we started this project, the sack of cement was 20,000. But now as you go to the market, it is 30,000, 37,000. Uh, then also, the changes in some of the designs, like maybe the tiring they, they anticipated, maybe water could go this way now with advice changes. So that the, those are the few things which has brought a slight increment on the price at which we have invested here. We had challenges like two years back, you remember when we came here, and all that confusion was being caused by our bad people in government. But later we harmonized that the project is moving on well. That's why you see now. It's something you can show the country and people can visit to see there is value for money. Even if it was a loan, of course we got money, a loan to work on this activity at first when the money got finished. We also used our own government of Uganda money in this current budget we are in. But this money we borrowed will be refunded back using the taxpayers' money. So it was just viable for us to closely monitor this project as Ministry of Works and Transport, such that we deliver the work, even if we're using taxpayers' money to pay back the loan, we are paying for something we have received. We have seen loans coming, they don't perform well, but at least we see here. And by the time we come back in January, there will be a lot of change. If they showed you are standing here, the lighting of this airport at night, you really appreciate the good work are done. So far, the airport have come and test all of these instruments here, it has already come. And all the tests have passed, which means the poor are handling this project together with the supervisors. They handled it with care. They will give you that video of what, how the area of you, both day and the night. You see, they appreciate this good work. So this one goes all to the government officials handling critical projects like these ones. We must handle such a projects with the heart of patriotism. That what we are doing is for the entire country, even after given politician, after given technical person retiring, the project should remain because we have seen people borrowing money, the loans come, but at the end all money disappears. And now government pays back, paying for nothing. So we are happy for this and we shall continue monitoring other programs and bring on board more both international airports and the regional aerodromes. Thank you. Okay. 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 Okay.
gengi de kuwa ikisawi cha kachuwete. Mm. Tulozenti ya mafuta gano. Ya mafuta gano, mafuta gano mchimanyi buru uji gama le miaka nyingi wa president wana gama le mela yo. Na yu president msefe nebo yajja, ya mafuta gano tuwa ugerera, chubanga rumone tani so kuwa ataka agonda. Aba mafuta, fwa baba luisa, kwa wanga mafuta genge de batu gamba, uh, by 2025-2026. We were able to get the first oil ministry of energy way to Gamba. I don't know if we were able to get the first oil ministry of energy way to Gamba. I don't know if we were able to get the first oil ministry of energy way to Gamba. I don't know if we were able to get the first oil ministry of energy way to Gamba. I don't know if we were able to get the first oil ministry of energy way to Gamba. Chochira giradala, tutuse kuli yengede. Katuba na Uganda, tutuka kuli yengede. Wafu, tuja kubanga, tumazo kubuwa. Na kubanga, sende, sinja kubaze yengede. Tukulama kubo, tukulama somero. Masinyazi katambule wona. Na wabaga lanti, umusara kwa Uganda, mutuja kubwa tufunye, niki source of income. Na mkafumete, walo oze eko. Katuongero kuruanyi sa, obuli kwenguzi. Ulichimucho no kulaba, nende sentezo wezitja. Uganda <laughs> 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 <
Four, maybe eight, but the big one is four, the maximum. You go to those big ones, the three for seven, you ought to know. Four. Yeah, they can be four. But, but the general, general purpose, aviation is more.